Hello, hello, Buzz. How's it going? Very well, Alex. How are you? I'm good. I'm good, man. What do we have this week? So this week we've got Boy Erased, uh, which mm. we watched on Netflix. And right. um, interesting film. Uh, it's got quite a few big stars in. Uh, so it's the Emmons family, Emmons family. Uh, so Nicole Emons, Kidman, yeah, yeah. Emmons, yeah. Nicole Kidman is the mother. Uh, Russell Crowe's the father, and the uh, the boy in the film is played by Lucas Hedges, and he's called Jared. And the focus kind of on Jared really in the film. Um, he's got yeah. highly religious parents in Nancy and Marshall. Um, yeah, yeah. And um, at first, you don't really know what quite is going on. You know, he's been like indoctrinated to some sort of group, and you don't really, you don't even, I don't really know what time period it was. It's just like it, it feels know, could like, be, it could, could, feels could be, like could be nineties, and it could 90s, be two yeah, thousands. You know, but I think like it is. It could be present day as well. It probably is present day. But um, um, sure. the 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 uh, attitude of his parents. Uh, is very old fashioned in which they are highly religious right. and you soon realize that he's been indoctrinated into a a summer kind of camp or something to to you know wish away the gay pretty much it's it's a it's it's yeah. a group of children who are obviously homosexuals or lesbians and um and 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 their parents believe that they can be ousted of this virus by going to cured. this this, this cured. Uh, yeah. cured cured you know so it's that it's yeah. that kind of dilemma you know and um you read it, the film it un, 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 unveils why he's there. You know, it's a bit of a slow burner. You know, about halfway through the movie, there's a scene where he has to come down and he confesses that you know he's been thinking about men. And and you know, it's got yeah, a lot of interesting things in the film. You know, I, I say it is absolutely. a bit of a slow burner. It's not too dramatic. But what one of the things that me and you were going on about is how like um, it's got this element of like Russell Crowe in the film, who's his dad. Um, he's, the, he's, he's also he's the like, priest. The priest for the community. He's, he's yeah. a priest. Yeah yeah. yeah, yeah. He's a priest as well. So it's like you know, doubly important for his image that he can't have yeah. a son that goes against the name of what he thinks the name, uh, uh, yeah, bad name of God would be. And um, it's like on the table with his parents. There's not even a discussion. It's just uh, you've done something wrong. Uh, or you're going to do stuff wrong and 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 you can yes. either repent and join the family again or essentially you can leave you know because there's a scene where um he says look do you want to change and i think the alternative is you're gonna have to leave the family if you don't because i can't have exactly. a son there's who, no option. who's, who's there's no option. Um, so there's, there's that no and it's, yeah yeah there's that and it's like that's one of the, an interesting thing because it doesn't even matter about homosexuals you know it's on the table that there's no discussion to be had you know you're going to go to his camp or not um but that was right. one of the things what did what did you think of the movie yeah first? so yeah, so basically this is somewhere in Arkansas, I think, and it, it yeah. feels like the late 90s, um, because it's a highly religious community. Uh, Russell Crowe, the dad, is the, the priest and also has a business, a successful business in the area, and the boy shows some tendencies of being gay, and then he's treated as if he's got a disease, and there is a cure for it. There is no discussion, there's no doubt that this disease might not be a disease. There's no, like I said, no discussion on the table, it's just you have it, and we need to get it out, basically. It's like mm -hmm. almost like having surgery, like yeah. me mental surgery, because he goes to this this program that he's up for. It, it treats him in the same way. So he goes to this, like uh, like you said, the uh, camp type of yeah. uh, program. And program, in that, yeah. In that, in that uh, uh, you know, the people that are, have been signed up there are uh, treated in the same way to a, to a point where at one point the teacher says that, you know, just like your... Um, convinced that uh, it's, he says something ridiculous and then is this uh, you're in ah, just like politics you're convinced of a of a party and then you can is in the same way you can be convinced that you're not gay and it's like not really but it's, it's just it's so yeah. in your face that's what was the first and, thing and, that and shocked me that, was that, that, that was one of the early examples in the group as well if you say yes. that the guy who was who was running the, the program is that he said uh, you know it's a choice to be gay and it's like you know I know it exactly. doesn't need to be mentioned if you've got half a brain cell but but like it's been shown yeah. that like animals have shown uh, signs of like gayness you know and that, and that obviously that's not a choice you know because we know Correct. animals don't choose to choose stuff but it's like affection you know Correct. among male yes, animals yeah. and, 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 for and, a, and uh, female for so, so yeah for a, for a child like him because he I think he's under he's under eighteen at the time when of the film when when the when it, this happens to him so legally he doesn't have much choice but mm. you know even if he even if he wants to go against his parents he doesn't have much choice but he doesn't he like he loves his parents and he, you know he respects them and they are respecting the community but he has nobody to talk with and then something yeah. really 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 bad happens to him without spoiling it while he's in college. 
But yeah, but because... isn't, isn't that, that thing that happens to him, that's what triggers the whole film off, really, isn't it? That incident triggers the whole film off, really, doesn't it? It does, yeah, because he, you know, he's so traumatized. before then, before then, so he, wasn't, he wasn't, yes. you know, revealing to the world that he's gay or anything, yes? Or he could get away with it. But yeah, before, well, yeah. because this happened, he traumatized well, he had a girlfriend, so didn't much. He? he had a girlfriend. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But also, he goes to the, uh, to the program before the college thing happens, remember? And then he goes back. So right, okay, yeah, yeah. So, ah, so yeah, he right, showed yeah, yeah, yeah. showed okay, some yeah, tendencies. Yeah. Then the parents reacted and said, "Let's go, go to it." But the whole thing, the the thing that shocked me the most was that how uh, accepting this mentality is in the community. So even in church, when he he talks about you know how much the devil can tempt you and things like that, the whole community is accepting of it, including the boy's mom. The boy's mom just goes with it with what the father says yeah, without no ever question. questioning questioning it. And then as soon as he sees that his, her son is suffering, is being massively impacted by the decision that they are taking on his behalf, that's when she tries to, 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 to doubt what her, her, you know, the, the priest's beliefs. And mm -hmm. that's when it gets really interesting. Did, didn't you thought the, um, you know, the, even the Russell Crowe pa uh, character started to shift a little bit, I thought? Yeah, yeah, you could see that. Kind of like the murmuring of the, am I doing the right thing, really? Um, exactly. And Russell, Russell Crowe is massive in this film as well, isn't it? I'm not sure if he's put on <laughs> yeah. weight for that role or uh, mm. that's just how he looks now. Because I haven't seen him in anything think, for a while. I think, he but... was I think he was preparing for another film where he is okay. going to be massive after, after yeah. that. But, Impressive. But, um... but yeah, but no, yeah, the, 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 the tide was kind of swinging, wasn't it? A little bit with his parents at, at, at one point. But, but but yeah, no, just to go back to that thing at the college, the incident that happened at the yeah. college, I, I thought, because I'm not sure if I've got the time timeline wrong here but i thought that's what incited him to go to the program because i essentially like there's a few accusations made at him at college and um, that um he the accusations that were made was what was he doing uh, but the rumours, the, those, 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 those rumours that were made about him and essentially his parents were, were just assuming that these rumours were true. Um, and then he came he came downstairs and he yeah. to have a chat with him and that's when he revealed, oh, I think about men. And I thought at that point yeah. they sent him to the programme. Yeah, yeah. Well, remember, the, the, thing, the reason why I said it, it happened before is because two mm -hmm. things. First of all, he, he broke up with his... Chloe, uh, wasn't it? Yeah. Chloe, yeah. Was, yeah. yeah. So in the car, remember that he they he said uh, you know he doesn't want to and then he doesn't want to have sex until he's married and I think that was just like that was obviously just a, a way of saying just you know I'm not interested in women. <laughs> yes, yeah. that was it, yeah, wasn't yeah, it? Sure. You know, yeah. Sure. yeah. But then the second clue that I had was when he goes to the program again. He that that colleague of his John which seems to be there all the time. You know, the guy mm. that was a bit itchy and a bit... Yeah, he's a little he, bit he looks skitty, like, isn't he? Looks yeah. like, and he says, he, you're, uh, you're, you know, you're returning again, as if mm. you're, is this your second time that you do the program. It doesn't really matter because that program is just unbelievably... It's just out of this world how how silly it is. You know, I mean, yeah. it, for, it it tells the, me, the the boys in the group to, you know, when they put to form a triangle, remember? And they need to put their hands on their shoulders, right? Yeah. On their hip. Yeah. Yeah, it, well, it's, 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 it's what, masculinity personified, yes, isn't it? Like exactly. that's what we're doing. It's any anything about that. It's, it's weird because there is actually a female in the group as well. Yes, so like exactly. it also, what would yeah. she be thinking when that she's saying lessons remember, and they're remember, all being taught you... how to be more masculine? Like even the handshake, like that was quite yes. funny that scene. Yeah, you got to have yeah, a proper yeah. handshake, and it's like it's it, it, it that that, that it, it, it's this amazing man because it that's another part of the, of the film which is interesting because there's obviously a problem again with masculinity being um, exemplified to that point like you know we're, we're trying yeah. to stride away from that so not only are they being completely homophobic for no reason and completely missing the message of you know everyone should be loved in the right way but they're also going full throttle on uh, you've got to be a proper man what is it to be a real man and it's all the wrong things for you sure. know it's not a, you know it's not how i would define yeah, a real man yeah. you know just because handshake's good there's a there's a scene i don't know if you picked it up he he tells the teacher tells the boys to keep their when they put their hands in their on their hips to keep their yeah. their, their fingers at the front not at the back but when actually he gets a bollocking from nicole kidman later on and they get in the car with the boy and say you should you know what 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 uh, professional uh, training you have are you a psychologist you're not are you something something actually the teacher holds his hands the other way I don't oh know really i didn't know yes that, yeah, 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 yeah. You, you, you play it back yeah, and no, you see I, yeah, and yeah, it's just yeah, yeah. it just shows you how ridiculous his teachings are basically so it doesn't yeah. fulfill what he's saying man that's exactly. that's the thing yeah 
so that's uh, Boy Erased. It's called. It's on Netflix. Uh, yeah, I, it think, has I think it's 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 a good film. Yeah. I would say it's not fantastic, but the, the questions it raises and the societal issues it kind of brings up are Correct. why I found this interesting. Worthwhile. Not worthwhile. the film filmmaking wise, it's okay, but like it's, it's, it's interesting questions, man. Agreed. Agreed. All right, sir. Thanks a lot. See you next week. Thank you very much. See you later, guys. Bye bye.